Ben back with you, and now we get a chance to let you know about the new basketball coach at Detroit Catholic Central. But if you follow high school hoops in Michigan, if you followed college hoops in America the last couple of decades, you know this guy. It's Tory Jackson. Coach, thanks for joining us. Nice to see you guys. I'm happy to be here, part of this stuff, man. This atmosphere is insane, man. This is bananas. No, seriously. Yeah. As someone kind of coming into the Catholic Central yeah. experience, what's it be like to be a part of this and, and be a part of the whole thing now? Man, I, I, I jumped into it right away, man. Just just talking to guys, the, the homecoming stuff, the atmosphere during the homecoming. We had an eSports assembly the other day, packed it out. The kids were insane. I, I only missed one football game this year. I went to every playoff, layered up, was in the rain, everything. So it's, I, I jumped into this thing, man. And then to be here tonight to see this crowd, I'm, I'm so happy I chose CC for sure. Obviously, you're coming from Grand Blank, Grand Blank where they had yeah. a heck of a basketball tradition. Yes, you played at Notre Dame, all the accolades there. Yeah. What kind of basketball identity are you trying to bring to Catholic Central as that coach? Just a tough mentality, man. Uh, CC, man, they're just known for trying to outscore guys. They got a lot of shooters, a lot of snipers, man. But these guys, man, they've learned a different style of, of basketball. They're learning how to communicate, how to play the game the right way, how to think the game differently, man. Uh, we spent a lot of time just watching film, things to do off the court, in the weight room, agility, conditioning. We did a lot of things mentally that cha challenged those guys to come out of their comfort zone. And uh, to see those guys answer the bell, man, um, I'm so proud of the guys, man. I'm excited for the year for sure. I'm curious. Hockey here at Catholic Central, that's an amazing tradition. Yeah. Wrestling does as well. Football yes. has a lot of yes. state championships. Basketball, to be blunt, yeah. hasn't been there. So how yeah. much of a challenge is it to get basketball to where you want it to be at Catholic Central? Man, it reminds me of my college days, my college choice. Notre Dame wasn't a basketball school. They had a little success here and there, um, made some sweet 16 runs. Um, but nothing consistent. When I chose to, I, out of all the schools, choosing that, you know, that school, um, it was a challenge. I knew going in, we had to figure out something else to do. And I scored a ton of points in high school. I wanted to find, I wanted to come out of my comfort zone, do something different, find a way to lead and find a way to impact the game differently so I could just expand my game. And um, went there, we changed the, the mindset. It became a basketball school and laid the foundation and things followed after that. And the same challenge happens here at CC. It's crazy how it's a coincidence, man, how ironic uh, and, and, and coming here and it's like a miniature version of Notre Dame. So I, I just, again, that's what made me jump into this thing right away. And I love it here. It's such a family feel here. And I, I can't wait to get things started. Yeah, we're going to cover a lot of Catholic League basketball yeah. in the prep this year. It's going to be very good. Woo. And St. Mary's is a player named Trey McKinney who's pretty darn good. <laughs> yes, but sir. give us a scouting report on your team. What yeah. do we need to know about the Shamrocks coming into the year? Uh, we're 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 more than just two guys. We get we get, you know, we're we're known for you know the the T.J. Nadus and the the Uchenna, the Uchenna Mene. They they are two two great alphas to have on the team. But now over the last few months, we've developed the other guys, as we say, the, the guys that will help us go. The X-Factors, the Devin Lees, the Sam Howard building his confidence. Um, Asher Asher played as a freshman a little bit as a guard. Now he has that swagger as that, that lead guard to help, you know, really uh, Uchenna so he doesn't have to bring the ball up and wear himself out. We became more defensive-minded, communicating, playing harder, being able to defend different positions. You're going to get a more well-rounded version, uh, a well-rounded basketball team, and we've done it We've done it as a family, freshman, a JV, and varsity. We've done it together. So that's the thing you're going to see with those guys, the, the unity, the one shamrock that we promote here, the unity you'll see that family type feel with us. Tori, welcome. As Thank a Catholic so Central much, alum, I was very excited to hear yes, you were sir. hired as the basketball coach. We're yes, glad sir. to have you, well although done. I'm not going to lie. Let's get a shot of this. <laughs> so he's rocking Jordan 11s, the cool grays. If you know me, you know that I'm supposed to be the guy who has the shoes. I got the, the Mocha ones on, but Tori beat me. So I thought we were friends, but we'll get over it. Oh, you good. We good. Next, Appreciate next you, time, baby. Next time. Tori Jackson, new head coach of Catholic Central Basketball. Excited to see what the Shamrocks will do on the floor this year. As for the